Uh, there is a uh, there's a new update and a new expansion um, called where is it? Return of the Goddess. Here it is down here. So things are on sale right now, of course, because of uh, of, of release day. This is this is out today. Um, I played Legend of the Keepers a few times here on the channel. This is a um, basically we're we're in charge of a dungeon and um, it, adventurers are going to come in. If you haven't seen this before, adventurers are going to come in. Our job is to put our uh, our monsters, whether it be um, you know, vampires or, or goblins or whatever, uh, to defend the place. This new expansion um, is a uh, is like an Egyptian themed thing. So we got mummies and and uh, snakes and and more mummies and that kind of stuff. So that's what we're defending our place with and canopic jars, you know, that, all that things. Um, this is by Goblin Studio uh, and Goblin's Publishing. This is a, a sponsored uh, stream. Thanks, Goblin's folks and Legend of Keepers folks. Um, and we're gonna try it out. So. Let's uh, let's uh, begin uh, uh, this one, and I'll get my stream set up here in a second, so we could, doesn't so it looks you go away, so it looks right. Uh, actually, it should be good. Are you a slave master in search of something new? Are we good? Turn it up just a little bit. Some of that. Some of that. Some of that. Okay, that should be a little better. All right, so let's try the new stuff. We're gonna go over here. We'll try a new save here. Yeah, that one. Uh, it's gonna be Nook. This does have um, Twitch stuff. I think last time I played it, I played it with the uh, with Torture, the Twitch. It's a passion. Uh, the, the Twitch, uh, um, what you call it? Um, and you can, like vote on things or whatever. But this time, we'll, we'll leave it out this time. Um, it doesn't do too much. Um, but for her, she 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 makes all kinds of noises. Uh, <laughs> Uh, essentially, she is a... Well, we'll take a look at it. Um, we get talent points first off, spin off. Well, she is a uh, like a like an Egyptian mummy thing. We've got mummies working for us. She's not a mummy. She's just a resurrected thing. We've got mummies. We've got ghosts. More mummies. More mummies. Gargoyles. And, uh, and some traps to defend things. First off, we choose what we're good at. And for... I play with this a little bit. And for what I discovered is that our... Um, our, our thing seems to be scaring people away. Not killing them, but just sort of scaring them away. Um, so, like, for instance, we get extra gold when someone flees. Um, here's a story of a sarcophagus. Lose morale. I'm not sure where that would come in. Lose, lose a percentage of their morale when entering the master's room. I get more life. The scepter of life regenerates my life. Um, mummies in the master's. So there's this thing with wraps, which basically just gives us a morale thing. Uh, and then we can have another thing with wraps. I'm gonna go with, uh, let's just take some gold. Like, when the, when the hero leaves, I'll take some cash. Seems, seems fair. We can customize things if you want, but we're gonna leave it as it is. There's the Twitch thing. Mm. Well, let's begin. Welcome to the company, Toeris. I know you are probably lost and frustrated to see how much the world has changed during your millenary slumber. Humans are no longer as docile as they once were. But with the help of the Dungeons Company family, I'm sure you'll find a way to help them remember how they should be. Okay. So, uh, this basically takes us through, like, there's several weeks, and we got adventures coming in, we can, we can defend the adventures, and then once we're done defend, defending the adventures, uh, we go, we buy new new monsters, or train the new monsters up, or get new traps, that kind of a thing. Or uh, make ourselves cooler. Um, we have, what else I know? Oh, this thing. Uh, this is just sort of stuff we've seen. Uh, I think we've seen all this stuff. Oh, what was that? A sacred lotus. We can find that, I guess, in the dungeon somewhere. So, um, yeah. Well, we'll uh, let's, let's go and kill some adventurers. Shall we? <laughs> so, um, we'll plan up our, uh, our, I think we got, we got a, uh, we got Sothi, what? What are you? Some sort of air damage, air mage? We have a barbarian named Valkram, and we have Sulia coming into my, my dungeon. Uh, as far as what I got, I got, uh, Kostotis, who is a big mummy, a mummy colossus. He's got a lot of hit points. I think I'm gonna put him on the front line. We've got Remini, the ghost, and we have Apu. The mummy servant. He's pretty weak. Not as weak as the... I'm going to put uh, Apu there and the ghost back here. Okay. That's our first round of monsters. Then we got a trap we got to put down. We got these canopic jars, which does a a, uh, a morale damage. 
and applies Raps. Raps deals 2% of maximum morale per stack to the hero who lands the final blow. So we put Raps on them, they damage us. I think Raps go on us. If they kill us, then they, we stack up these Raps, and if these... You'll, you'll get it, you'll get it. I'm sorry, I'm doing a terrible job of explaining it, but you'll, you'll figure it out. <laughs> Modified Fancher. And that gives tiredness, which makes him weaker. Uh, and then we got more monsters here. And uh, we're going to put in... We got another another big mummy colossus. So we'll put him there. We got a gargoyle. We'll stick... Uh, sure, we'll do it like this. And then there's me. Ah, pray to me. So, we just want a little prayer. That's all we ask. Yeah. <laughs> that guy's miss... So I, I saw this, I played this, this before, and I noticed, I saw his arm was missing and bleeding all over the place. I thought maybe I damaged him and that was an effect, but no, he just walks into the dungeon with him, missing an arm. Um, and every character has two, I think sometimes they have three choices, maybe it's just two, of what they can do. So we can either attack the bat guy for 40 morale damage and give him tiredness, or we can just hit all of them for 15 morale damage. Uh, yeah, just smack that guy in the back. Why don't you? He's our initiative over here. Uh, we can scare for more 40 morale, or we can do, do damage and demoralize the guy. Uh, we'll just scare the front guy. Dread Pirate Roberts there. A big part of the game, right now it's not too big a deal, but things get more difficult. And the, a big part is is monitoring what their damage versus my resistances are. This guy, you can see, does nature damage. And uh, my guy is uh, is resistant to a bit of nature, so that's good. You know, uh, he is not. Um, but he just attacks the front, so we can't hit him anyway. So this is the thing we can we can put um, soul absorption. We can put wraps on ourselves, and then um, we have an attack that removes all of our wraps that we have on ourselves and puts bleeding per stack. So it's sort of a thing we stack on ourselves, and then it does something good once we die or that happens. So we'll just do the soul absorption thing. Uh, we're all gonna die. Um, you know, we're the monsters of a dungeon. We're all gonna die. It's just, can we kill... Can we get them before they kill all of us? That's, that's the question. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll smack this guy around. Keep his tiredness going. Keep his damage down. And, um... You can see what's gonna do to him. Yeah, we'll just scare this guy away. So if we scare him away, we get tears. We can use to buy things. There's two different currencies. We get tears or we get, uh, blood. I think it's the other one. All right. Um, we can almost scare that guy off. Yeah, we'll scare him off. Get that front guy taken care of. We didn't do anything to the the middle guy. We did nothing to the middle guy. This should scare him off a bit, though. Nothing more terrifying than a than a few canop canopic jars. Is that the one that... Uh, maybe I should put that one in the back, because it has the, um, the wraps thing. Demoralize all of them. That'll run the, the first guy, I think, away. She's for na nature damage. What do you guys feel about nature? Yeah, you don't mind it. Or we can uh, add wraps to you. And a random bonus to the next monsters we've got. Um, sure. Okay, and they're tired. The fan makes them tired. So now this is our final group of monsters. Yeah. Barbarian is being a jerk. We've got raps all over us. Uh, human mortality. Rap and grip. That guy again. That, that'll scare off the front guy. Let's get him out of here. Get out of here. But you know, what do you got? Like one? He's got one morale. Okay, we can damage the front guy. He's gonna leave anyway, and we'll just we'll just scare everybody. Okay, there he goes. We got him pretty pretty low though. So you got a lot of wraps. So it removes all stacks of wraps and applies bleeding to the front guy. Let's do it. We got four of those. We got four bleed now. Minus twenty life for the next what five four turns. How much life do you got? Hmm, that's something. The bad guy. Okay. 
Um, yeah, let's, ooh, more, more bleed. More bleed. That guy's bleeding. There we go. Uh, remember, I get gold if I scare him away. Maybe we should focus on that. Now we tore these guys up. This will get that guy to go away, and it'll damage. Um, or removes all bleeding stack or all wraps. We don't have any wraps on this guy. Let's go. Could have him dead if I'd done the other thing. This will get both. Yeah, this will scare. Ten gold. Hey, Gavin Hawk, how's it going? And dead. Okay. We did it. What do we want? We get Futakuchi Ona. What is she? These two have been in the game before. I've not seen her before. Um, Succubus is always really good, but I'm curious about her. She does a bunch of morale damage, which I think is good. Um, yeah, I'll take her. I'm not sure what she's supposed to be. Alright, so we can go to train her and train one of our guys up. Spend some gold to train our, our monsters. We got a little bit. We can buy a new monster, or we can get a new trap. Um, let's, keep, let's train up somebody. What's, what does she do? All monsters of this group gain guaranteed critical at the start of the fight. I mean, that seems pretty good, sure. I don't know if you're any good, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to love you up. Uh, and then you get a gain wraps when the mummy colossus is attacked. All he uh, demoralize one to all heroes at the start of, the of my turn. It's one when he's attacked. This one just gives two when he's defeated. Or we could save our cash. Uh, we'll get we'll get old, old Apu trained up. Okay. We can do it again, I guess. Let's go to an event. Cleaning Goblin comes to you uh, comes to see you weeping. Zluby, his pet stick insect, died in a mopping accident. Will you take Zluby to the resurrection room to harvest the goblin's joyful tears? Sell the corpse to a gourmet chef for organize a funeral. So we can sell the guy. We can resurrect it for some tears. We don't have that. Or we can organize a funeral, which is ridiculous. Uh, wait, wait. It gives us tears at the cost of some cash. Yeah, I only have eight tiers. Sure. What a sad, what a sad time. Uh, we'll, we'll check out the event. These are the, um, these guys will come in and they'll drink my blood uh, and uh, give us some money. It's a Japanese ghost with a second mouth on the back of her head under her hair. Great Japanese ghost stories. Oh my. I don't know any of that. I never heard of any of that. Wizard with a strange hat has fallen from the sky and landed in the entrance hall. He was carrying a magical artifact. Troll beer. Monsters placed at the front lose minus 50 speed, but their maximum life increases by 50%. Sure, I'll take it. Um, yeah. A lot of the front guys don't usually go first anyway. So. Alright, so. Um, this will give us more, uh, um, the, uh, the wraps thing. This one just makes him tired. Does less damage. Um, we'll do that one. And this will be whoever has the rap bonuses. Like, oh, there she is. Guaranteed critical. Let's put her in there. I'm going to put her in the back, I guess. You damage the front. You damage everybody. You damage everybody. Nature and fire. I'll stick her in the back. You can go in the front. And you have the wraps thing also. Go there. Okay, that's when I do my thing. And then we're going to put in a fan. And then we'll do that. Uh, there's old Rebu. Um, that's fine. Pray to me. Did it only hit the first person with that morale? Uh, uh, the morale damage? Hans, the minstrel, the magician, and uh, what are you? Priestess. Are you going to do some healing? No. 
All right, um, let's do this wraps thing. Applies wraps when he's defeated. This guy swaps me around. He's a jerk. Um, pretty good damage. Get that that uh, that the dang bard. Get him out of here. What rats? We love rats. Fire damage seems like a bad thing for mummies. Maleficent Bolt. Harassment. Damage taken increased by... Oh, oh, make him vulnerable. Let's work on scaring this guy back. This bad guy away. Okay, wraps. Wraps. Put some bleeding on that guy. Girl. That nature damage. We don't mind nature damage. Nature damage is fine. Okay. Um. Could almost scare that guy away. Do that. Do they do that? Oh, she's dead. What is that? What do you have on you? Um, oh, you have this this thing. Okay. Oh, it does it for everyone that's in the front. I get it. Or just because you were the beginning at the, at the start, maybe. Probably. Get that bleed on, because you're going to die anyway. Why aren't you bleeding? We get to go again? Okay. Oh, right. Bleeding only if I have if I have wraps on. Um <laughs> Hey Mirogram. Yeah, I know it's early time, isn't it? The sun's still up? Well, I may not be anymore. It's it's still the previous day. <laughs> What's gotten over me? Oh, I don't know. I'm losing my mind. All right, we can demoralize everybody. We can damage Mr. Uh, front guy. We can kill front guy. Uh, we get some wraps for the next folks. Um, we can almost get the back guy out of here. He'll be gone soon enough. Let's get that first guy out of here. Slowed to hero's position behind him. That'll, yeah, that's good stuff. Throw some sand at him. Very mummy style. Guys, no problem. The music is the music is great. I, I didn't really pay much attention to it before when I was when I was playing with it around a little bit. So we can scare. Uh, yeah, let's. We don't care if we do that. Let's do that. One. Gives me wrapped, right? Or is it not? Did I do that wrong? I looked at it wrong, didn't I? Oh, that's just that one. Uh, yeah, we'll just keep on. And then sharp horns? That's nasty damage, that guy. Okay. Ooh, a mummy scarab. Ooh, what do you do? I want the Scarab, though, just because it's... His name is also Dynastut. Yes. It doesn't matter uh, what your... Uh, who you are, if your name is Dynastut, you're welcome in my in my place. Let's buy a new one. What do we get? Ooh, check that guy out. There's so much new stuff. Um, there's a Vulture. It does air damage. Attack an additional time if at least one hero has been killed. Ooh, that's pretty good. But I really want this guy. Can I have both of them? Yes. I'd like both of them. I don't need both of them, but I want all the new guys, so... I keep on doing that. I keep 
whatever. We'll do the, um, yeah, we'll do this. I'll let you drink a little blood. Uh, I'm on a conversation for blood. So you will take 260 of my life, but I get money for it. Uh, what's going on over here? Oh, this guy. New archivist, new stuff. We found a bewitch glove, apparently. All right. Um... So I can give you some blood and and get money, but yeah, I'll let you, I'll let you drink a little bit of my blood. It's fine. Since we volunteers to go plunder something, let's do, let's go do some plundering. We're gonna send. Um, who wants to go? Is it all three of them? It's three weeks. Three weeks. Ten weeks. Two motivation, and you just give me cash. Lots of cash. Risk of injury is pretty high, though. Let's just do the easy one. Three weeks. Yeah, that's fine. All right. Uh, yeah, I guess we're sort of dungeon ma dungeon mastery. Base. Yeah, pretty much. We're 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 just assigning the monsters to defend what's what's coming at us. Uh, I don't. Have, well, I guess I do have money. We could buy another monster. But I don't know what's good. Yeah. Let's just do a business trip. Who wants to go on a business trip? You can go for five weeks, new guy. You're injured anyway. You don't like it. Let's burn all here's when the demon is defeated, huh? Uh, to be their bodyguard, you'll become sated, of course. Do I get this guy? Let's burn all heroes when a demon is defeated. When a demon is defeated? What does that mean? Not sure. This guy will just give me cash and that. This will give me cash and blood if Rebu goes away. Um, yeah, we'll send you away, buddy. Go get some. Go get motivated. I'll take out some. I'm a little worried about because I sent everyone away, but now we can do it. What's a what's a few adventurers? Uh, some uh, good adventurers they call themselves. Look at that guy. He's frozen here. And he's not even wearing a shirt. What an idiot! I thought she was going away. Um, and we'll put in this guy. What do you guys do? Front damage, front damage, front damage. Okay. Okay. That one. Put you in front. Uh, I want to see what Buzzy does. Buzzy can go there, and then you can go in the back. I want to see him, though, too. Okay, fine. I'll take you out. I'll put, uh, put the bug in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, uh, this whole, this whole, like, expansion is all themed. All has sort of a, um, uh, Egyptian theme. You mean, like, um, so, like, this guy is a nature damage, a nature and air damage guy. So, yeah, later on, we'll, we'll, so we'll sort of learn combos of who works well together with other folks. Like, for instance... She will, um, I guess she would go good with someone that does a lot of damage, because the damage taken is increased because if she's around. Um, so someone that does a lot of, a lot of smacking would be good to have her around. Um, we could do, for this first round, let's just go and just evenly distribute some, some, some terror. Okay. You hit the back or the front. Just scared. Of him. It looks hefty until you see until you see my guy. Whoa, 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 whoa! Never mind. Take it back. Like, see, this is forty-eight, and this does more than forty-eight. Yeah, we'll just we'll just keep it keep it spread out. That was a lot of damage. Oh, she's gonna die! Alright, we got them though, no problem. They got a lot of health, but... They're very scared. The guy in the middle is very angry. I don't know exactly what that... Uh, there it is. Damage taken unchanged. 
because he's unwavering. What about you, though? You are frantic, so you take more damage. 50% of human maximum morale when another hero is defeated. Oh, okay, okay. Demoralize everybody. Yeah. Solar Eclipse. Ooh, neat. That always really demoralizes me. <laughs> right. Right. Simoon. Sure. Where's my bug? Yeah, here we go. Scarab Swarm or Quicksands it will terrify you, which hurts your morale even more. Any reduced resistances with this? Yeah, let's just keep on scaring people. You might be able to scare everybody off, huh? Not quite. Oh, you're so close. What are you at? One morale again. Can you get both of them? No. I was looking forward to use that one, so if someone dies... That one's not, the Vulture's not going to be very effective, because you're all, like, physical damage. I don't know that we're doing that. And they're both out. Okay, here we go. Flame Eater, or, uh... Is that a Catman? Bastet's Disciple. Sa. There's lots of physical damage. He has a lot of morale damage to the front guy. Um... Two stacks of penalty when the most stacks apply to the target. Yeah, we'll go with, with Catman. There's, a, there's, a, there's some demons there we were talking about before. Uh, when they run away, they uh, they drop 10 coins. It's okay. What's this one do? Morale review. Um, we'll go to a merchant. But that's no armor. I think last time I played, I did a big po I, I went all like poison. I think it was last what I did last time. Poison dart was one I used a lot of. Um, I don't really want any of these guys. We can renew it though. Twenty gold. Oh, a sphinx. And slowed. We get another one of her. I wonder. Put more vulnerable on people. Nature damage, nature, nature weakness. So those two might go well together because of the damage thing. Um, I kind of want to see it. Hmm. I don't have any, any nature ones, but I'm going to buy it because I want to see it. Okay, what's that? Since obsessions stay at the gym, master has to stay fit. Inadequate resources. All right. Let's go to the therapist. Employees have a therapy session paid for by the company. Killing humans is a difficult line of work. You often have to leave your conscience at home, particularly during torture sessions. This session will let your employees talk about their feelings and let out some steam. Motivation gained for all available monsters. Um, yeah, we'll do one for... Um, we'll spend some tears there and get that one. Sure. You send one of your tra employees to an intensive training course or just a trainer. Let's do that one. And, uh, can I train you again? I can, and it makes you even cooler. Yeah, let's let's work on her. We like her. There you go. Make you cool, and I want to make Mr. Brutalis, I think, good. Or this guy. This guy's pretty good. What else do we like a lot? I like this guy. This one. Uh, old rem Remain here. I think I like, so we're going to go ahead and train him up. And I'm going to give one to Mr. Brutalis. Okay. This is for... Um, that's that one again. Um, I think my people are fine. We don't need that. What do we got over here? This archivist again. You don't have to tell me every time, you know. It's fine. I, I, I'll believe you. Oops. What was the other thing? I, I had something else. Um... 
Oh, this one. I actually messed with this one. We can change who's in what room. Who's in room one, who's in room two. Um, which is important later on when I figure out who goes well together. But I still have to, I don't figure that part yet. yet. Um, this guy does do a, a nature damage to everybody. Nature damage. Maybe we can put the Sphinx in with him. Maybe we'll go with like her, um, Brutalis, and Remain. We'll be my three there. And then we'll try. I don't know, we'll stick Saw over there. And Apu needs to be over here somewhere. I don't have a tank over here. I guess we got Custodus. Give me my tank. Or maybe this guy. Got 90 health. Oh, here we go. 120 health. This is my tank. The Beetle, of course. So he can tank. And we'll have... Elemental Weakness. So it would go good with the um, Sphinx. So, Beetle, Sphinx, and um, maybe the um, Cobalt, whatever he is. Yeah. Sure. Um, what's in event? Uh, during your break, you played the famous fantasy role-playing game, Houses and Humans, with your employees. They learned a lot about themselves. Plus one motivation. Yeah. All right, adventurers. We're, uh, is there like 50 weeks in a year? I don't know how many weeks there are in a year. I don't know how it is in real life, but not in this game. What we got? Uh, uh, what are you, a barbarian, a scholar, and a scout? Are you the one who switches people around? No, but you give maximum morale back at the end of each, start of each turn. So we had to kill you. So my 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 good tank is gonna be is of course Brutalis. He goes in front. This is the big the big squad. You go there. Um, I don't want. Do you have how many? Who's better at defending? Eighty hit points. And she's gonna do physical damage. You have armor. You don't have armor. So and you're gonna go. Actually, you will go there. You will go there. Modified fan. That's very 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 clever. Put some thought into that one. Okay, um, and then who has the who has the armor? Not you. Got a nice axe though, buddy. Uh, neither of you do. Okay, you'll go there and you'll go there. No one's made it to my main my boss yet. Okay, so this quad, um, you can do damage. I'm just gonna do more, more, 50 more. You can like destroy that guy in one round. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we we upgrade the boss. We we picked one talent point, which is we get 10 gold whenever they run away. Uh, but yeah, we can we can uh, uh, level up in time. Make her sleepy. I don't like her. Oh, there, Brutalis. Seems like a lot of extra, a lot of wasted um, damage there. You can demoralize that. Three. What's that? Oh, still alive. I've seen a, I saw a t-shirt, a Houses and Humans t-shirt, a while back. I, I have a D&D &D game that I play on, on stream. And for the longest time, I've been trying to think of a, of a name. And I saw that one time. I thought it was clever, but then I... It's apparently a lot, a lot of folks use it, so it's not as clever as I hoped it would be. Are we going to kill him in the first round? That's embarrassing. Oh, yeah, you can see. I, I didn't even realize. There's a, there's a mouth on the back of her head. Ah. Creepy. And 
Hanging in there. Oh, yeah, we're in on the first round. We win. Um, ooh, that's... Monstrous Alter does morale damage to the back. Saw cuts people up. Icy Breeze does ice damage. Yeah, we'll take a... That. I'll change up my fan. We have a merchant coming there, so let's do a therapist. And... We'll make people nice and happy. Workout is for one... Uh, oh, it's for me. For me. Um, I'm going to ignore this until it levels up. Uh, and we can buy another monster. Mm. Yeah, fine. I'll do it. Five resistance for, tw for 30 tiers or more hit points for 20 tiers. I will take the hit points. 65 seems like a lot. What do you get? Sacred Lotus. Yeah, 18 weeks is a long time, buddy. And I kind of, I just found a use for you, but... Go do it. Alright, we're going with the veterans because... As we just discovered... Ah, uh, we're too good. <laughs> see how that works. Alright, we got uh, a tier 2... An old tier one Hans back here doing nature damage. Lots of nature damage. Area, back. So someone who can resist nature would be best to have in the back like this. That guy might be better to actually put in the back. I'm going to reduce. Do we do some, reduce an armor anyway? I'm going to do it. You're going in the back to defend that. Which is just that one, basically. And you're going to do physical damage in the front. Break my armor. Um, which I guess is going to be you. And you can sit in the middle here. All right, um, we can demoralize the back guy, or demoralize and do the rap thing. Yeah, that's cool. It's always difficult when I make my I play this game several times on the channel, and when I make my thumbnails, it's always difficult because um, it's really good, really fancy looking artwork on this. Hard to decide which I want to do, which I want to put out there. Um, you resist nature, so I'll put you in the back. And uh, we're gonna put Saw. Is that who's going in there? Yeah, sure. We'll put Saw in there. He hasn't done much yet. Ah, pray to me. <laughs> Speaking of artwork. <laughs> <Yeah>! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Why is he not taking any damage? What's he, ignore the first round or something? Immune to master spells. Morale loss is reduced by 50. Why aren't you getting, beating, dodges the next attack? Well, that's unpleasant. That is so much, so much damage I could do to you. Fine. Oh yeah, I'm gonna. I wanted an area attack to be the one that we waste on that. What's that do for me? I'll get wraps when attacked. Okay. Like this one. This would probably be a good one to just throw out. Yeah. Now we can do some damage. Assuming we survive. It's just a tanning boost. <laughs> All right, buddy. Prepare to be harassed. And and again. Uh, that's damage. That's damage. I'm trying to figure out if that's physical damage or uh, uh, both. I can't tell. I don't know. Was physical. Ooh, I blew up. That's embarrassing. Okay, you're all we got. Scare that guy away. Please, because my trap's gonna work. And it's gonna scare him. 
Please run away. Please run away. Now, oh, come on. We're wasting like 40 morale. 30 morale on this guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Okay. Good. Good. Yes. Good. I'm looking at the wrong one. Maybe it's the other one. Oh, yeah. That's the one that does the back. 40, whatever. Um, one guy. Um... Whatever I do, I'm not doing. Oh yeah, you you resist it, so whatever. <laughs> You're insulting bards everywhere. Feline roar. Yeah, yeah, get him, kitty. Oh yeah. Um, damage increased by fifty percent if armor if armor is negative. Is it? It is! Oh, I did the wrong one. Whoops. I meant to do that one. It's okay. We'll get some, we'll get some blood. Um, oh, an artifact. We have a uh, two-bird stone. Attack, uh, attacks targeting only the hero at the front deal 30% of the final damage. Only the hero at the front deal 30% of the final damage to the hero positioned behind the target. Only the hero at the front. Okay. Heroes with less than 50% of the maximum morale lose 30 to all resistances. That could be good. It's terrified to all heroes when demon is defeated. I don't really have any demons. This one seems good, so if, if we attack solely, specifically the front guy, it damages... The other guy. Or this one, if they're less than 50% morale, they lose all their resistances, which also could be very good. Because we're doing morale things. Let's do that one. Homeopathic poison. It sounds very effective. Uh, doctor will fix me up, but I'm already fixed up. Is this all it is? Uh, yeah. When do I get more levels? I feel like more levels, please. There it is. Okay. Where will we get more levels up from? Let's do a trainer. And let's get... I get... Um, this guy's got a lot, of, a lot of armor. We give him more armor. Sure. We're, leaving, we're using you, so we'll, we'll level you up. How about, what do you do? Transmute blood to tears. Eh. Walking through the corridors, you notice a monster waiting for a job interview. You could hire the candidate right now without intermediaries. On the other hand, what makes them think you can come in uninvited? Hire him for 62 or intimidate him for 10. I'll intimidate him. Get out of here. Let's plunder a nearby place here. Uh, next dungeon, haste for all monsters. 100% chance of, hit, of hurting one of our guys. We may get a new guy here, so we'll do that one. Monty snuck into a prison and left a trail of blood on their way out. They've emerged unscathed. We don't have resources for course, so we'll do an event. Two of your employees have been caught red-handed brawling like two L's for a hairbrush. Will you be tough and suspend them for five weeks or threaten them with a pay cut? Be sure it won't happen again. Always buy them a second hairbrush. So we got Rebu and Remain here. Uh, I'm not going to ignore it because we need a Remain to be happy. So I'm going to just ignore it. I'm going to I'll give them some beer. I'll tell them to stop it. All right. What do we got here? We got a Sorceress, a Disciple, and an Exile. You do not. You do a lot of air damage to the back, ice damage to the front, air damage to the front. Anyone have air resist? Mr. Brutalis does. You have a lot of air damage. So air in the back, air in the front. Okay. Um, Remain has a lot of air damage also. I mean, yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Let's try it this way. Um, yeah, 
next group of monsters needs the needs that. And then I um leveled up old Apu here. Okay, we'll put Apu in. To me. All right. Um, who are we, who are we scared of? Can't be affected by demoralize. So maybe middle guy. Although we can't do much damage to middle guy. So let's do it. Let's do what we can morale wise. Keep it on your resistances, so I want to see what happens when we drop you down. Oh, wrong! I, I hit the wrong one. Boy. Okay. Try to get you down below half, so we can see what it does for you. Uh, and here we go. So, yeah, it did go down. So error was like what twenty five, and now it's now it's five. Cool. I guess it was. I guess it was thirty five. Okay. Hey. Punch my ghost. Look, it's gonna be kind of tough. He can't be demoralized. What are you gonna deal with that guy? We might have to kill him the old fashioned way. I guess we'll just scare that guy off. Yeah. Alright. Um. This will be good. This will hurt his resistances, so we'll be even m more uh, damage, I guess. The difference is the, the damage, I guess, the resistances. But there's not a lot of resistance things we're really dealing with. We're just doing morale damage. That's not resistance. Applies to moralize, which we can't do anything about. Nature damage slowed. Good though. <laughs> Big part of the game, Alejandro, is whenever you get like right now, we're just sort of building up a crew bit a, a bit. Um, when we get into it, a big part of the game is is sort of matching up your uh, your monsters to work together. You know. Like our make sure our make sure our nature damage guys are working with the nature, um, nature resistance removers guys that kind of thing. Um, if I scare him off, it might scare her off also. Yeah. Ooh, I leveled up. I will take um, regen, ferocious yawn, air damage and morale. Uh, goes up. That's that one. This is the um. Regen, I don't care about regen. I'm gonna take this one, I guess. Alright. Um, let me get my monsters here. Whoops. Get back in there. Okay, you're in there. This guy's gonna be away for a little while. Um, let's do some training. Can I train you again? Give you more damage. Should I do that one? I can make you even cooler. Romani? Romain? Okay. 
Yeah, let's do it. Let's put it all in her. Let's make her extra cool. I like her with her strange face on her head. Enthusiast has tracked an artifact to you and would like to buy it for a very attractive price. He seems to carry other similar objects on his person. One well, of your boys would be able to steal it from him without noticing him. Deal a, um... Yeah, steal it. Nice. Black market, what do we do here? Sell monsters that are no longer useful to you, unavailable, or injured. Okay. I will get rid of... I think I don't want this guy anymore. I know I bought him, and I, I, he was alright, but I'm gonna get rid of him. And I think I might get rid of... This guy also, even though he's pretty cool. These two. Okay, we'll do a business trip. Um, I should go for five weeks and get some morale, uh, which probably a good idea. Yeah, good addition. getting a little low there. What do you get? An unholy shroud, fifty percent uh, to apply frostbite with monsters attacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which deal morale? How much maximum life as ice damage per turn? Maybe. Let's let her take a little break. Hey, Nazagi, how's it going? Hey, Dakota. I'm a, a champion, huh? I'll take it. Let's do it. A champion? Is my what's-her-face? Is she ready to fight? I don't think she is. What do we start with? Start with... Um, we'll do this one first. Spooky music. Uh, yeah, she's not here. Um, what are you doing? So you're attacking air damage up front, fire damage in the back, physical damage in the back. So resistance, folks. Air and physical. So you're going in the back. Actually, what was the air damage? Air damage is in the front. Look at that. Look at that wrong, but it's fine, because you can go there. And I guess Rebu is going to, uh, join his buddies back again. Alright, um, you, and you, I think you, no, no, get out of there, I'm, I'm going to put Apu in there, keep our mummies together, check this guy out, champion dwarf. I think we're going to, uh, yeah, we'll stick with another thing, you know, we sort of just hit everybody. We can, first group, your job is just to weaken everybody. And then we go we'll work on whatever we can do. Let's get that dwarf, get him out of here. Who is this? This is you, you got four wraps, so we could do that. That's bleeding on. Keep them, just keep the morale going. Seven wraps, let's do it, because that's going to be a lot of damage, so let's smack this guy around. I'm not sure we, we care about that bleed, but that's 35 life. I think it's 35 life, four, seven turns worth of damage. Is that correct? Yeah, he took 51 damage in that one round. We'll kill this guy. Okay, we'll kill him the old-fashioned way. So we'll damage that guy, we'll hurt everyone else. Yeah, let's let's uh, let's smack him around. How do you feel about nature? He doesn't mind it too much. Slows him down also, so we get a chance to fight before he does. Okay. Yeah. 
Why do wraps cause bleeding? I don't know. Um, more, uh, more damage and more bleeding. Yeah, lay out. Okay, he's gonna take a lot of damage if we bite him. Just scare the guys in the back. So I'm just gonna get to my, my boss, I think. Anything to her, other than get her a little, uh, oh, she's unwavering. What'd you do to me? Air weakness. Okay. I can scare you away when I have to. Let's work on scaring her away. Make the best okay. Sacrifices. This is the first time making it to her. Eleven damage. Thirty-one. Ouch. Okay, yeah, we gotta kill this guy. He's gonna bleed out, but I think that we'll do this, and then the bleed should smack him around pretty good. You took 104 damage. There he goes. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. Uh, yeah, we'll hit you with the morale damage, because that's what your, uh, that's your problem right now. Get out of my dungeon! And give me your tears while you're at it. Ooh, what is this? Ooh. Okay. Okay, that is, a, that is a gruesome surprise. Nightmare Catcher. Demoralize. Deal 200 physical damage instead of morale. Nah. This guy, though. But he's so he's so cool looking. He's got 100 hit points. He's resistant to some things, but not fire. I already got some of those, even though he's pretty good. We're all taken from attacks and traps. Increased by 50% is what is what the Terrified does. Um, I mean, that one's really good. I really want the tree. But this guy is way better than what we're do for what we're doing right now, so we'll take him. All right, little motivation problems with the uh, what's his face. Um, nah, I'm fine. I'm fine. We got a trainer coming up here though. Um, yeah, we'll do it. Let me get. Um, I suppose we should give folks that we use some bonuses. Like we've been using the cat. I like the cat. Let's get the cat bumped up. Um, and I think we're gonna give Brutalis a little more health, a little more levels here. Oh, I can give him more levels too. Yeah, rem yeah, get some levels, buddy. Okay, that's all my money. I can't afford anything else now. So I could have upgraded my, my traps, but I just spent all my cash. Yep, I can't do anything else now. Um, I want to make sure that things are organized here. So we got traps already set up in there. Um, are you still away? I mean, she's back. That's good. So these three will do their thing. And then we'll, we'll, he'll come back eventually, and then we can have him back over here. Okay. Veterans, of course. The tree guy was better. Tree guy's cool. Next time we get a um, a merchant, we'll go and uh, we'll have a chat with him. This is good. Uh, we got to start with this thing because it's it's basically the same thing, but doesn't do the wraps thing. These these both are good. Demoralize is just like a tick. And this one is increases the damage, which that's what we're doing. So, yeah, put them out there. And then we're gonna go. We're gonna do some scaring with um, what are you doing? Front nature damage, front physical damage, and everything. Okay. So Mr. Brutalis is gonna go right there, and you're gonna hang out back there, and you're gonna go right there. Let's see if we can take him down in the first round. Uh, Saw will go in, and then Ab Abu. We have Apu and Abu. To me. They die at the red. I think if they if they lose all the red pips, I think that they um. 
I think they're just, they're just like exhausted. I don't know. You know what? I don't know if I've actually hit that before. I guess we'll find out. Poison damage ain't so bad. Are you like resistance or something? Why does it seem to be doing anything to you? Why is it moralized? Minus 65 morale. Why is it offering? I can see the shield. Oh, is it here? I think I wasted that. These guys have got some morale. What do you got? 245 morale. Morale damage taken from attacks and traps. Um, I'm tempted to just hit him because it's half damage. But alright, we'll hit him. Yeah, he comes in missing an arm. I'm not sure what happens. There we go. Hang in there, mummy. He's still there. He's doing good. Uh, I can kill that guy. He's going to take... How much... You got 32. But then he... Hmm, that's fine. Just, just get that guy. Seems handy. Die next turn. Um, scare or no, nah, not front. Random, random bonus. The next group of monsters. Sure. No, no. Yeah. <laughs> so what's going on here? You can hit everybody. Dodge next attack. Um, he's gonna go down anyway. I'm assuming that's gonna hit him. <sighs> Unless that tick counts as an attack. And it does not. Oh, the tiredness is killing him. Is is hurting him pretty badly. I would like, um, that's one we, we buffed up before, or was it this one? It was this one we did. Let's, yeah, let's keep doing that one. Uh, well, there we go. So I guess he's out for nine days. They both are for nine weeks, because they're sleepy. Let's train some folks with our little bit of cash we've got. Uh, I can't afford her, but I, I, I like the cat. Let's, let's bump the cat up a bit. Sell something. Do I have anyone to sell? I don't know that I do. I want this one. 150 bucks. I can't afford that one. I can just do 20 tiers. What sanctuary? Sanctuary is a, a, a ceremony as gloomy as it should, just to make the adventurer's life worse. Okay. Penalty damage taken increased by 30%. Uh, sure. Oh, yeah, my chat's a little bit in the way of those things, isn't it? Um, let's go plunder some things. I'm out of I'm out of currency. But, <laughs> that's what you need to know. Uh, I can probably move myself over just a little bit. 
Actually, here, let me move this. I'll just stash it up here. I'm going to put myself, like, right there. Um, plunder. Um, next dungeon. Haste for monsters or... For some cash. It's probably worth it. Yeah, yeah go get it. And my, my favorite guy got hurt. Got some cash out of it, though. Oh, this is the champion. Okay. I should have, I should have saved. Oh, man. All oh, my good guys. Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> this might be a problem. Okay, so he's back. Um, Uh-oh. Uh. <laughs> well, uh, okay. So, it's we're going to put him. Luckily, she's here. And I guess you are going to go in room one. And then we'll let these three do uh, room two. And then uh, Abu, you just sit and you just hope we don't die. Great. So three of my main guys are out for the champion. Yeah, Pondo was a bad idea for the one the, the next week. I didn't realize. I wasn't watching. Um, how, how tough are you, uh, Mr. Champion Archmage? You do some ice damage in the front. You do ice damage. You do fire damage. Okay, okay. You got a lot of hit points. I'm going to give you a little gruesome surprise. I hope you don't mind. You can be terrified, right? And then we're gonna hit you with front ice, front ice. Um, I guess so. I put you in front. You got a hundred hit points. I guess so. You can go there and then you're back there. This little Inuit guy here, a harpooner. You don't mind ice damage. I'll put you up there. And then we put in that one. Tiredness is really good. Now that I have discovered tiredness. Maybe better than just the minus 40 morale of one person. And tiredness too, to, to everybody. That fan's actually pretty good. Ah, pray to me! I'd like to go first, please. Thank you. Um, yeah, let's just ruin the day. <laughs> Man. Okay, that's more like it. Get her out of here. Do something. Some morale damage goes with the wraps. Hang in there. Let me swing one more time. Oh yeah. No. Ooh. What you got? Three hit points. Excellent. Excellent. Take that and get out of here. Nice. Okay, one down. Um. I'm not sure what the what the solution is here for you for uh for front guy. I can give you slowed, which makes you not attack so likely. This just seems like it's not gonna be very helpful. What's it, 44 morale damage total? No, it's it's five times two, so it's it is 34 morale damage total. I'm gonna put slowed on him because I think maybe us going first is a good thing. If we can all get a good attack in here, it might be nice. Mr. Lizard Man can't, but... More tiredness, please. I guess we're gonna go for this. We're gonna try to scare him away. We are, um... We're not Gold Thor. We are, um... Taonet or something. Taonis? Teneus? I don't know. What, uh, it stacks to all penalties of Tide, so it's going to add Tiredness, Slowed, 
on also. Is this correct? Yeah, check that out. Okay. Make you real tired. Plus, are you at half yet? You're like one point away from, uh, you're one point away from half. Let me get you down there. Okay, your resistances are much different, much better now. If that matters much. Which I think it does. I think we'll be alright. Uh, ooh, ooh. Even though, um, I'm on the boss here. Damage Bow reduced by 20%. The lowest morale percent. This one applies tiredness. Let's keep him, keep him extra tired, because that's what put him at. Yeah, he only did 21 damage now because he's got minus 50%. Never weighed on that, so we don't we won't do it again. 50% max. And now we can go and do just like morale damage or whatever. Fear the mummies! What's my name? My name is Tawaris. This won't quite kill him. Terrifying laugh. <laughs> Ouch. Man, take it easy, buddy. Wow, you got. There is still time to me. <laughs> cut me up cut me off in the middle of my monologue. He's in for like hundred points each. Man, this, this guy's so mean. My knee. Ooh. Maybe I should put this back on. Elemental weakness. Man. On morale and damaging them. There is still Two more rounds. <laughs> Next round, we'll get him. Man. That guy was not nice. That was the final guy, though. I now understand how the ancient temples of the Nakra Delta have remained untouched for all this time. The humans of the old empire probably shouldn't have forced the locals to open them, eh? According to our latest reports, they've accidentally opened a demonic portal only a few dunes away from you. Good news for us. And then I bellowed, this tomb will be your tomb. <laughs> Not bad, eh? Not bad at all. So many levels. So many levels. Biceps. Okay. Let's go to level two, I guess. Um, more talents. Just like that. I saw this destroying a sarcophagus. Lose ten to twenty. What does that mean? They lose morale when they enter my room. I get more life. Regains my life. I have better chance to start with wraps. Or mummies and masters' power is increased by each stack of wraps they are benefiting from. Let's get this one. And then... Oh, I can't... I forgot, oh, I have to do this one, too. Enter air damage. Um... I don't know what I want. Got one more to spend. I'll keep that one. 20 bucks whenever they leave. Sure. Sure. Okay. Um. Let's see here. Hmm. 
<clears throat> All right, so we're gonna we're gonna mission two. Just a, a little sleepy. Do I, I have the same monsters, right? Oh, I don't. I get all new monsters, but I want my old monsters. I like them. Endor's box. Ten morale. Stacks of all penalties applied to heroes increased by two. And protective tablets. Uh, what kind of monsters do we start with here? Morale guy. Uh, morale guy. We could try looking at something else, like maybe an air damage group, because we do have a couple air damagers. There's a nature sphinx. Ice damage. We could try going damage, I guess. I don't think it's a good idea, though. I want my old monsters. Okay. Uh, we'll take out some veterans. How tough can they be? Not tough at all, I say. Easy. Alright, so we got... We know this guy's a good defender, sort of. 120 hit points. His name's Coconut. What are you guys going to do? You're going to do fire damage, fire damage, lots of fire damage. Apparently, they're a little bit more organized. I have. What are you, like a genie? Oh, okay. Applies shell. Damage taken from attacks reduced by 20. Seems, seems useful. So none of us mine fire damage. To me. Oh, we have a chance that monsters defeated will come back to life as a skeleton warrior. Holly. My guys. What's going on over here? I think we have to stick with the with the morale and the tiredness and all that. I think we just that's kind of what we're built for here. No, that guy's here. I forgot he was here. He mixes me up. Um, let's get, um, now we'll work on the fat guy. I'm committed. Immune. Oh, demoralized. Ouch. Ouch. Uh, can he stop? Yeah, we have a new, uh, a new, uh, DLC. Just come out today. Yeah, they're kind of tearing us up. Back to the old level one monsters. It's a little, um, a little embarrassing. Tiredness 2 to everybody. That's that's good stuff. Who's doing this one? This guy? Okay, I like that guy. Zednin. Zednin, you're my new my new favorite. I think you're a girl. But I I appreciate you. I don't know what you are. Oh yeah, you're a demon. No damage of a type equivalent to the target's lowest resistance. Huh. That's pretty cool too. Damage and morale ricochets to the hero position behind the target. Morale is under 50%. And it is. I guess if it is at time of casting. Uh, if your armor is negative, it is not. So we'll just do some. Shake the ground a little bit. Poison damage never hurt. Oh. Resistance. Now it will work well. Yeah, check that out. That was nice. I'm committed. If you can survive again, we get one of those more of those kopeshes. Yeah. 
Excellent. Nice. That guy. That guy's my new friend. I need to need to get him working with me. Um. I think. I like these guys. These colossus guys. Before we we had. Also, he has tiredness. We could just work on keeping him tired. Keeping him focused on that. Yeah, we'll, we'll get a mummy servant. I need some tanks, I think. Let's get a trainer. And buff up my, my new friend. And uh, and this guy also. This guy's also a hero. You get wraps when monsters... Uh, when a monster of the group is defeated, you get wraps. I don't care about that, but get 30 healing. I, was, I, I forget, I have two of these. This guy's good too. Okay. Spend all my money. We can buy a new trap, I think. Um. We already have one of those. Price Dungeon right. right. Company would like you requisition some of your equipment. If you help, the sales company should try should last only a few weeks. I guess I'm gonna do it because I don't have any other choice. Okay. It's my only one that I have. Can I have another one, please? Brewer behind Strangle Stout, the world-famous beer with a delicate aroma of stagnant slime, is looking for hero tears to make a whole new blend. Pay you in as much beer as you can urinate. Can you make a contribution? Sure. Do you have points for uh, leveling you up again? I do. Zednin. He gets more da more uh, damage there, better passive, more resistances, all good. All my money's gone. We're going for veterans too, just because we get better stuff. <clears throat> all right, what we got? Um, air damage, physical damage, ice damage. All right. This guy's at fifty percent resistance for air. He has a lot more hit points, though. Go there. Um, you're going to go in the back, I guess. You can go right there. Maybe I should bump up. I should level up Coconut and let him do um, the other round. I don't have more traps. <laughs> he loaned it out. I guess you're going to go in front. <laughs> that Kefris guy. Uh, is a good one to have in the second row because he does a good thing once their health is at half or morale. Make him tired. There we go. That's a nice one to have, and you get uh, you have a, apparently a good speed, so it's nice to have. You. That's good. That's real good. I'm already taking 20% less damage from everybody because of because of that guy. I wonder if it'd be, if it'd be wise. Probably not. To have two of these guys in one in one grouping. I'm not sure. They don't do a ton of damage, they just sort of, they just weaken them enough to where they're not hitting so hard. If we have those two though, and then one person who does like a, a big, they can do a big hit, that might be nice. I think this is best. Keeping them around because then the star of the, star of the combat, that one. Keep them weak. They can do half damage. And then uh, this guy's going to be great because he's going to go through all of them. Got a good system here, I think. I'm 
Except for you, buddy. Mr. Sphinx is, is not, uh... I don't really care about you. Quick way, I guess. There we go. Got some blood that time. Um, plus we're get 2% additional damage per missing life percent. 200% um, physical damage instead of morale, if they're demoralized. Or we have monsters placed at the front, gain extra speed. Yeah, I want that one. Make sure we go first. Okay, people get a little tired. Uh, I can't afford anything. Let's go have an event. R&D director has created a centrifuge that can transform blood into tears. Um... Was that 5 into 30? I, I read that wrong. I just quickly uh, blinked through it, and I didn't realize that would have been a good one to do. What do you have a star for? Upgrade a trap. Yeah, let's, let's upgrade a trap. Okay, Pandora's box has been fancied up. Um, we'll do another event. During your break, you played the famous fancy role-playing game Houses and Humans. We do that a lot. Why wouldn't you? Uh, transmute. There we go. It was 15 to 30. So, I mean, yeah, it's good. Um, these are sometimes good. Like that, for instance. You can place... Only place one regular trap, but it gains multi-action. Plus one trigger per stack. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll take that. You want to go against a champion right now? Yeah, we do. We do. Of course. Of course. Why would we not? What kind of question is that? I don't know. Did I pick a difficulty at the beginning of the game? I don't think I did. I think it I think it just ramps up as you get into the game. Now, this means you only place one regular trap. Right? So we can do this guy. Tax all penalties applied to heroes increased by two. But they're not going to have any penalties at the beginning of the game. So it's not really a good one. Let me do this and see what happens. I'm guessing I can't do another one. Uh, what do you do? You do uh, physical damage, fire at the front, physical in the back. Um, we, don't really, we don't really like fire. We really don't like fire. Who has the hit points? Coconut does. So coconut, you can go there, you know you don't like fire. Yeah, so I can't do a second trap. Okay. It's fine, I think, as long as the trap... That, that box, or the Pandora thing, would be good as long as the... I don't know. Actually. Hmm. Ah! Pray to me! And you're gonna do it again, right? Yeah. Okay. I don't know if that's really that good. I guess it is kind of good because we can just take that one trap and just put all of our bonuses into it to make it a really good trap. Rather than having to deal with two of them, I guess. That guy. That's my. That's the champion, isn't it? Attack applies stunned if Huntress is affected by at least one penalty. Oh, we gotta get rid of her. Um, yeah, I could skip the first one then, but you're right, I probably could. Yeah. That probably would be wise. We get the shell. 
So damage taken from attacks. So we were taking less damage from attacks because of the shell that's on us. And I guess there's two stacks now because of the bonus. Can you be terrified? How many times have I gone? There's two morale now. How many times have I done that? Yeah, it works. Yeah, because it, it, it stacks with tiredness. Oh, we killed somebody, so we gained some morale. Get out of here. Now they're both below half. Which we want. Holly. Um. <clears throat> Get the tired going, and we'll throw a Kopesh. I like that guy. Um, I guess I'll just do the. I guess, uh. Um, oh, oh, I didn't even realize. I was like, who is this guy? <laughs> hey, hey, buddy. Um,. Chance to get stunned. That's always good. Stunned? You failed. You failed me, buddy. And look, look, and she stunned you. It's embarrassing, buddy. Poor doggy. Infernal Guardian. Remember, applies multi action on the next regular trap. Twenty percent chance to deal critical strike when attacking. Um, these are all really good. Hmm. Look at those hit points in that guy. There's our tank that we need. But this is really good too, and this is great. So can I stack this with the one I've already got? So I have like multiple attack stacking thing with the shell and all that. The lure isn't, you can only place one trap. Is this a trap? Is that what it, is it? I guess it is, isn't it? Okay. I'm taking big guy. Because we need we need a good tank. And that, that's our tank. Uh, I don't need healing, so we're going to train somebody up. Let's train up, um... I can't afford that guy. So we'll have, so we'd be Balam, Kefris... And one of these guys will be my, my back line. He does nasty fire things. I can train you also. To make you even more better. I want to spend all my money right now or maybe we should save it. I'm saving it. What do we get next? Can I... Oh, I didn't mean to... I didn't mean to click that one. I didn't mean to... I, I didn't... Mm. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, this is the the blood tears thing. Oy. Golthor, the destroyer. Do you have a, a moment to spare to talk about our lord and tormentor, Golthor, the destroyer? I sure do. Um, I could kill you for some blood. I could refuse for some tears. I can accept for some morale. I'll take the morale. For in case we get a, a master bonus. I've not even been paying attention to this. We get gold with, with them. We have gold. These guys would give us... What's disaster mean? I'm not sure what that means. 
They would give us a master bonus. I mean, that sounds like a plan. I like master bonuses. I don't know what it is. But I'll take it. Ice in front, nature in the back. What's nature? Um, alright, so I think that's your job, buddy, is to be up front. Even though it's gonna hurt you. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I guess we'll put that out. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Okay, Balam. Why does he have a star? What's so cool about him? What's a, what's what's special about that star? Do you mean he's some sort of fancy of some kind? Ah, pray to me. All right. Compare those folks. Ah, uh, you dang, you dang. You dang bard! Oh, I'm gonna scare you. No, I'm not. Hey, Haley, how's it going? Star means it's rare. Oh, okay. You have to always just keep that, that, that thing going. Get the naked guy scared away here. Hang in there, buddy. Like that. See, that's the other good thing. He blows up and he's, he, and he does all kinds of things to him. Ooh, yeah, nice. One point from half, which I don't think I care about now, right? He's just a damager. Um, there's a chance he can stun him, which I don't think is going to matter. So let's just bleed him. I guess if I stunned him, there was a chance I could have another round of fighting. He might kill me, though. He does a lot of damage. A lot, of, a lot of bleed on him. What healing? Outrageous. Two morale. I'll take a random bonus. Give me something good. Hey, buddy, I'm counting on you. Oh, are you, uh, you dodging the next attack? Why? We'll get rid of that. This guy. He's trying to get on my nerves. With his two morale. And his frantic... Demeanor, incinerate, you have one attack. Okay. On the, yeah, burn him. Okay, okay. Okay. What are you at now? Three? We're gonna kill this guy, so I'm gonna go and do the damage one. Which I think the other one does damage too, but we're gonna do that damage. And then you have negative resistance because of the fire, so we're gonna burn you some more. That's pretty cool. I have somebody that does like a like a resist like a weakness thing. Maybe we should find someone to, to meet up with him to does the was it you? You just target the lowest weakness, but you're at minus 35 now. That guy's nasty.
I'm going to take the, um, the solar eclipse this time. Um, I do have cash. Buy a new monster or trap. Let's go on a business trip. Five weeks. 14 weeks for what? Miraculous pill. Monsters placed at the back perform an additional attack but lose 20 speed and start fights with less health. Doesn't seem all that good. Uh, I'm not going to send Zen in away. I don't want to send you away either, but it's five weeks. So we won't have a, a fight, I don't think, for five weeks. I don't think, anyway. What do we get here? Oh, you're just telling me about him being gone. Um, I could risk selling my Sphinx and hopefully buy one before the next round. Otherwise, we're going to be two people. Or uh, end this guy. I'll be short. Uh, I'll keep him around just for just in case. Get rid of the Sphinx, though. Which I think was the one... That maybe helps uh, elemental stuff. Hey, John. How's it going? Uh, we can boom. Oh, yeah. Let's do this. Make our trap better. Shell two the next monsters, which means it's going to be 40 and then four shells. I'll take it. Can I have both of them? No. And then we will um, train our active monsters. I want you to get leveled up. And... Um, you could use some hit points. Um, I spend money on you. I'm gonna save my money. Oh, wait, hang on. What, what can we do? What do we get? A monster, a trap, or an artifact? I want an artifact. And he's still out. Uh oh. Um, let me put. Yes, you need to go over here, I think. <laughs> um, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. We got a ninja, a tracker, and a and a concertist. Concertist. Is that how you say that? Concertist. Uh, you do nature damage everywhere, fire damage back, and physical damage. So you do a little bit of everything. So fire damage in the back. All right. And you do a bit of nature damage everywhere. Okay. You should also probably consider... Um, the first guy, the guy in front gets to go first. So I should consider putting who I want to go in first up front. Like this guy. Who's going to go first probably anyway because of his speed. Uh, actually, he's going to go first. So no matter what we do, he's not going to go. They're all in the hundreds. So the only one's going to help is me. So yeah, well, sure, we'll try that. Put him up there. You can go there and you can go. Oops. Ah, pray to me. <laughs> Hello, John, again. Next one's gonna be avoided. So hit everybody. Yeah. No more damage, please. Oh man. I forget this guy does a tightness also. He's pretty good to have around. To the back, anyway. I if it's a wise way of setting up where we focus, like, as long as they all attack the front, 
you know, um, or all on the back, so make sure we, we do damage focus fire, basically. Um, yeah, I'll try to stun him. Uh, yeah, I did. I did see that one. I I, I played a little bit of that one, uh, John. I, I didn't do it on channel, though. I didn't do a video of it. Um, yeah, I played around with it a little bit. Looks pretty good. I'll take the... Um, I'll take the random bonus. What did it do for us last time? I don't remember. What do we get? We get resistance bonus in our wraps. Oh, he had that thing on. Hmm. Oh, just for the morale bonus. I need to get, I need to get her down. Is it three now? Is that what you're doing? Yeah, the tired is three now. So that's the guy that has it. So whenever he dies, he gets, uh, environmental weakness, elemental weakness. Um, by 20. So he does go good with, with the battle or whatever the name is. I'm not sure what we're going to do with this guy. Still got a lot of them around. I know a way to pull your brain out through your nose. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Fear the mummies. There is still time to <gasps> I've had a pretty easy time this uh, this time around. I, when I played before, I've gotten beat like in the first round just because it's um, just, well, I guess I, I kind of know what I'm doing now. Um, but really, there's a lot in building your heroes to match. Maybe not necessarily in the first one, but uh, that's a good one. That troll beer is like is, is nice. I place terrified to all heroes when a demon is defeated. Mm, I only have the one demon. This is applies burn to all when a demon is defeated. So if we had demons, it'd be good stuff. I'll take the troll beer, I guess. We only have, what, five of those? A little, little Naram needs a, a snooze. Um, I'm going to upgrade my tramp. This one. 40 morale, so it's going to be 80 morale. I like it. Merchant, I don't have any money. So we're going to work out, I guess. I will take a bit of... Um, I don't need... Uh, I guess I do need a little regen. I'm getting plenty per week. Ah, I'm fine. I'll take some of that. Oh, I could do both. Okay. Uh, these are the blood guys. Maybe I could do that. I'm getting regen. Maybe I should do that. All right, Troubadour offers a sink for your employees in exchange for a, sm a modest f uh, sum. With the right employee, you could um, convince her to sing for free. Hey, yeah, buddy, why don't you go, uh, go have a chat? Can I? I can't afford it. Uh, I can't afford either of these, so... Come have a drink. One short. 
Okay, what do we get? Monster uh, master bonus versus a trap. I'll take a, I'll take a uh, that one. I just don't know what the disaster is. But my buddy's back. So I think we're going to leave it like like that. Is that what we want to do? I think so. These these three. Yeah, and, and these three. Okay, I think that's it. If I had a chance to sell my to sell my my uh, Pandora's box, I may I think I may do it. <clears throat> reduced trap damage, morale losses reduced by fifty. This is all kind of bad stuff. Um, what do you do? Nature in the back, air in the front, air in the back. Whoever goes first, we want. What are you at? You guys are all slow. We're all going to go before you. Nice. Air damage. So you're going to go there. Um, you're going to go front, I think. Yeah, it's no ice damage. Something's hilarious. Are you the resistance too? She's going to be kind of tough. She, uh, was she a sorceress? Heals 25% of one hero's max life after a fight. So we, gotta make, we probably should get her out of here. Quickly. Also, let's just, uh, maybe I can. This round. Ah, good. Good. If we get some skeletons coming in here, we might be good. Twenty and then an additional fifty. That's thirty-five, right? Yeah, five. And so, yeah, we'll just. Mm, just. Uh, you've bad armor. Try to get him below fifty, so then my my guy can can do their thing. Too bad, it, too bad it caps at 50. I think that trap is doing us a lot of good. That plus the, 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 the that thing. It's good stuff. They got me tired now, too. Get her out of here before she heals somebody. I saw that. I, yeah, they released a whole bunch of old Star Trek games. Some of them not so old. I think Bridge Commander was in there that the, that GOG put just put out. Yeah. Star Trek Armada. Oh, Armada is coming out as well. Nice. The old solar eclipse. Did we get you did we get him below half? You're gonna you're gonna burn. You don't you don't like fire damage. That's a shame. Birth of the Federation. I love that game. I know I've told this story before, but I was. I was in high school, um, land party, me and, and three other friends. There's four of us. 
playing Birth of the Federation. Birth of the Federation, by the way, is like it's like Master of Orion. Or it's like it's like um it's like an RTS version of um Master of Orion, I guess. Uh, space RTS. Um, is, that the, is, is that what I'm thinking of? Or am I thinking of, of, of Armada? Am I, you know what? My, I've told the story so much, I've forgotten which game it is. I think it's that one. Um, it's worth the Federation. That's the, that's the Master of Orion one, isn't it? I'm confusing myself. And Armada is the RTS. Right? Birth of the Federation is the one where, like, you're the Romulan Klingon or whatever, and you go and you meet the, uh, Mintar, Mintarian. Okay, right, okay. It was, it was Armada we were playing. And we were each in each corner of the map. There's four of us. And it's somewhere, those of us, those of you that have played at a LAN party, you know what this is like. Um, but we had a disconnect somewhere in the middle of the game, and, and the game didn't tell us there was a disconnect. Um, and so, like... We're playing for a couple hours. Disconnect happens like maybe 30 minutes in. And so we're all like sitting real quiet. And because on each on each of our screens, we're all destroying someone else. I like I was a Romulan, so I snuck into someone's base and I was secretly destroying their base. Um, however, there was a disconnect that we didn't know about, and so like it automatically turned everyone into AI. And so we were each basically playing single player games. And each of us was was destroying uh, the other ones, uh, sort of. <laughs> so, that's my uh, Armada memories. Uh, I think this Fear of, Mummies, Fear of the Mummies is probably a good one to have because of... Oh, that's a good one, too, though. I want to go out... I want to go out every time. This will come out only if I'm around. I'll take that one. Yeah, everyone was a winner. That's right. <laughs> it was funny because, you know, Land Party... Everyone, normally everyone's just yammering on and chatting whatever, but everyone was really quiet because we were all doing the exact same thing. It's like sneaking in and attacking other people's bases and thinking we were getting away with it. Because in RTS, you have to like watch your mini-map and know what's going on. So we thought we were getting away with things when... No. Next, The next two groups of monsters. Okay, okay. Let's go on a um, a business trip. For five weeks, you get some morale. Fourteen weeks, you get attacking target only. Target targeting only the hero at the front deals thirty final damage to the hero position behind them, or just a bunch of money. But we got to send our buddy out there. I'm gonna send you because I'm not a big fan of uh, of you. So just give me some cash. All right. Let's see. Um, do this and uh, get some people all happy. Nope. Okay, what do we want? Get a monster, a trap, or a trap. I don't want either of those things. Uh, I might get a good monster here. Good gold out of this one, though. Do we want just just the cash? We can like sell the thing. What is it? I don't know what a disaster is. I'm gonna take it and we're gonna see what is a disaster. Uh, that's all good. Coconut's gone, but we don't care about coconut. Alright, um... Ice in front, fire in the back. No, no, ice and fire in the front. Well, that's not right. Ice and fire. Oh, hey, look at that. And you get to go first, which we want, which is going to happen anyway. Uh, we're all going to go first. Okay. So the trap really only does me any good. That bonus I've got is really only good for if the trap comes before us. Next of all penalties applied to the heroes increased by two. That actually might be good having this one here now, though, because they're going to have they're going to have stacks of things. And so now it's going to get four stacks of that stuff. Okay, let's try it. Hey, gamer, Mr. PK. How's it going? Alright, Balam. I need to level you up, buddy. Do I want you in front? Uh, you don't like ice damage. We'll just make sure we kill that guy. Then everything will be alright. Ah, pray to me!
Okay, let's do some impairing. I'm gonna avoid that guy, because Eduardo is a jerk. I'm gonna get as many stacks of things I can get on these guys. If I have an option to stack things, I'm gonna do it, because when we hit that trap, it's gonna be nasty. Like tiredness, for instance. Why'd you resist half that? Oh, initial duration of penalties re received decreased by one. Oh, you killed my guy already! No, you didn't. He's back. So, like, for instance, demoralized, I think, would be a good thing to have. I think. Would it, though? Yeah. He only gets two. I'm good and tired, which is, again, is only one because... Oh, you popped my head off. Knock it off. Yeah, we ain't making it unless he turns into a uh, skeleton. So there's some stacks on though. We got demoralized and we have the uh, resistance reduced. So let me hit him. That's something, though. It's going to be a six now? Yeah. A five. Okay. Oh, sorry, Mr. Gamer. Gamer, Mr. PK. I, I remember those days. Uh, I, I, I I miss them. I miss having uh, like a little seven-month-old uh, until, until nighttime came around. Then I like having a five-year-old. I like having a five-year-old that sleeps through the nights. Uh, select a, a disaster. Okay. Well, this seems kind of nice. I don't remember seeing these before. Uh, let's scare that guy away. I should have put my other trap here. That's where I should put it. I didn't realize these things are going to stack things onto him. This guy's done for, though. Right. Ooh, there's a Naga. I was looking. I was waiting for one of these guys. Uh, air damage and ten morale. Ricochets the hardest uh, guy positioned behind. He would go very well with Mr. Kopesh. We also have the cat. I like the cat a lot. But I just want to see what this guy does. So we're bringing him in. Uh, Naran's a little worn out. Um, uh, let's go and yeah, we'll do a trainer. Let's level up him. Let's fight weakness to all heroes when a monster in the group is defeated. Doesn't really do me much good, but it does give me hit points and all that. What do you do? A lot cheaper. Um, a lot of money. Man, I don't know. Twenty more health. That doesn't do much different. More resistant. Is it more damage? Is it the same? More morale. Or uh yeah, more power, I mean. Um I don't know. This guy's expensive. Um fifty percent chance to st apply stun if the morale's under fifty. That's what we want. That's very good. Um, and then applies that. She gets 10 on everything. Okay, buddy. I'll level you up. And we have another trainer. Um, let's go to a, an event. Maybe we'll get some money. Track down an artifact. Uh, chance monsters defeated. Come back to life as a skeleton. Can I have another one? Oh, he wants that. We'll be able to steal one from him without noticing. He's not going to take that, is he? As long as he doesn't take my other. I like that. My monster. No. Gentleman in, in the guise of a toy manufacturer knocks on your door. Santa Claus offers to sell you a range of amusing items. He requests nothing in exchange other than the materials to make them. A strange and troubling force physically prevents you from declining. Minus 130 life if you choose to pay in life. So we can say... Ice damage from monster attacks are dealt to the target's fire resistance. Hmm. 
50% to apply Frostbites. Let's just place it at the back, perform additional attack, and lose speed, less health. I'll try it. Oh. Um. I don't know. Um. I don't know if I want to, but we're gonna try it. Is this the last one? Oh, not quite. Having amongst colleagues is always a joy. We are only not human. Now let's have a seminar. Burn two, uh, motivation, or uh, a little speed boost. Uh, can I have all of them? I want that one. Okay. How many weeks was there before? Is it forty weeks for the for the full thing? Anyone, anyone remember what it was for the first act? This is good. Here, this will give us shell for the next two groups. We got this guy again. We've fought him before. What do you get? You do ice damage in the front, fire in the back. Oh, I gotta remember to put someone that's right. I forgot. Uh, this guy probably should go in the back because he's gonna probably go before most of them. Yeah, even with his debuff, but he's gonna get to attack twice. Ice damage. You don't like ice. Me. Big snake. Stick with our scare tactics. So that gave you a reflex 35% of the damage taken as fire damage. Why do you have that? You had that last time, didn't you? Yeah. A shrill shrout. A shrill, shrill shout. Ricochet the hero. Uh, you're supposed to be in the back line. I forgot to move you. Yeah, I should have put you. Whoops. He needs to go in with this group. Him and I guess... I guess... I don't know who's going to go switch out with you. It's not ideal here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. Shrill, shrill, shrout, shrill. I can't. I, I just can't do it. <laughs> Uh, damage dealt 100%. It's still good morale damage. We'll do it. Yeah, look at her. Look at her. Yeah, look at her. That'll scare her off. Ouch. Slash, slash is no good. There's a bleeding thing, but I don't know that I care about it. Uh, there's a chance of stunning them. That's what I want. Hey, there we go. Nicely done, buddy. I'm gonna die now. But uh, you done good. Ooh. Yeah, you got to go in the back. Increase by 100% if he's the last remaining here. She's yeah, she's got to go back here. Stun him again. Um, let's see, what can we do? Um, scare her away a little bit. Do the bubble bonus thing. Yeah, let's get some demoralize, demoralizing happen in here. You know, take him down a notch. Plus, we got you down below 50 now, so Mr. Kopesh can Kopesh away. Holly! Okay, now you get to go twice, right? Because you got your whole bonus. Right? Benefit from the artifact's miraculous miraculous pill. Miraculous pill again. 
please. Twice? Twice? Yeah, there we go. Look at that. It's at six now. That's nice. They're gonna die. I wonder if I should put this guy back here. He should go in the back, I think, because he's gonna do... He's gonna go last anyway. He'll take a lot of damage, but he's got a lot of health. So we can do his fire damage thing twice? Maybe? Is that better? I think it is. Okay, go incinerate somebody. Do you get to go twice now, also? Oh, you do. You always get to go twice. Okay, so we're gonna put beefy guys in the back. From now on. I've never seen a lightning strike. Let's do it. Oh, we can, get our, we can get our tree this time. We get another one of these guys, though. Okay, we're gonna go with the tree, just because I wanna see it. We'll have a tree in the front line, we'll have, um, yeah. Okay, let me, let me. Good work. We'd like to offer you a promotion. What are the, offer you one of the sarcophagi, which will have its own dungeon room. Hmm. Terrified. Three random bonuses to the master when the sarcophagus is destroyed, or a hero lose 10% of their maximum morale when it's destroyed. What's Terrified do again? Terrified is the, um, that's good. Plus it does that? Assumes ten tears to summon two random mummies. Let's do that because I want to. I want to summon some things. Okay, now I want to make sure we get. So you have to go in the back room, and then I think. So I have you, you, and I guess Balam will be in the back, and then Zednam here will go to room one. I don't know what we're gonna do with Naran when they come back. I guess I'm gonna go. They're gonna stack up here. Oh, we got him too, though. I don't know. Maybe the Naga will go out. Okay, I'm not sure how that works. I suppose we'll figure it out. Um, um, Let's do it. Hey, Brock. How's it going? I think we're near the end, so I'm not going to I'm not gonna send anyone away. Uh, but I will train some folks if we can afford it. Uh, that guy can get trained. Sure. Alchemist. Nah. I think we're near the end. Slimy yet satisfying. <laughs> this is the Lion King. Uh, a giant worm has oozed its way into the lower levels of the dungeon. What will you do with it once you've killed it? Um, I can eat it for some life. I can offer it for some happiness. I can sell it for some gold. I'm going to offer it for some happiness. Okay. Um, let's do an event. Uh, old Zluby died again. I will take... I can't afford that. So let's just resurrect Zluby. Well, let's sell him. How many more of these do we have? Master bonus. Like master bonuses in like my master gets a gets a bonus. All right, so this is the first round, so we want to do this one. Now, what do you do? Nature in the back. Um, you don't mind nature. You're a giant tree. You're gonna go slow anyway, so you go there. I'm gonna put fire in the front. And you there. Week 52 is last. That makes sense. Yeah, we just got an extra room in there. Okay, that's kind of cool. That's neat. Maybe we'll get some mummies. 
Um, and then in the back here, I think we want... Look at this. Look at the fire resist on that guy. Oh my. Okay. Um, I'm tempted to put him in the back because we can just throw that thing around. But no, we'll put we'll put him. We'll put him back there. We'll see how it goes. Not time no resistances at that. That death damage is kind of nasty. <laughs> They're all going to get to go. Um, you're probably going to die. You might be resistant of that nature. I don't think he's going to get to go. Um, yeah. Yep. Yeah. I would have gotten the go if I hadn't died. If I had done the, the bat thing. It also puts demoralize. It, it sticks demoralize on him. I have to make sure I start saving up some tears, though. We're gonna need it for my my ruin or my uh my oh, old mat here. Stack that tiredness up. Okay, now what happens? I'm curious about this. That didn't do anything to me. <laughs> Consumes 10 tears, summons two random mummies. Um, lose morale, doubles the tears gather, gather from the target at the end of the dungeon if he flees. Well, he will flee. How many tiers to get, get invulnerable? I don't think I need the mummies right now because I think we're going to win this one pretty easily. So let's do that. Give it this guy's nasty. Am I just immune to him? Um, why can't they kill me? Immune to damage and penalties. How are you supposed to kill it? He's invulnerable. He's still just invulnerable for two more turns, and I can just do it again, I guess, and do it and get more invulnerability. All right. Give it. He's gonna run away anyway. Just might as well use it though. Sixteen tears out of that. She's invulnerable. Oh, maybe not. I think she's invulnerable. Guess not. Give me uh, this, is, this is the last guy, right? Um, hundred percent more damage, yeah, because it's the last remaining hero. Nice. You got the sort of Loki thing going on too. Are you invoker. Cool looking. How do you feel about fire? Uh, you don't mind so much. Let me go again. I have still thirty-five. Can't be affected by penalties. Uh, get out of here. Max life plus 130. Man, that's like one attack. 
with the big guys anyway. Okay, uh, let me take a quick pee break, and then we'll uh, we'll finish this. I, I, I want to get this done, so we'll finish up this um, this thing, and then uh, and I'll come back. So I'll be right back. Give me just a minute. All right. <clears throat> Okay, we just got a few more weeks left, so we'll we'll, we'll finish this thing up. Um, since things are going pretty good here, so um, I got a trainer right there. So let's go start with an event and see what we get. During your break, you played famous houses and humans. We do a lot of that. Yeah. Train somebody here. Can't afford anybody. Uh, I do use you, um, and you're gonna get what? More damage, more uh, more health and things. Sure, I don't use you. You are pretty good, though. Maybe I should start using Anpu. Maybe I should move, switch out this guy for Anpu. 50% chance to stun things. That's why we have him around. Okay. Uh, let's go... Um, there's the champion right there. So let's do a business trip, I guess. I have, I have to. Um... I don't want to do any of these. So, no thanks. Um, did I do one? I don't think I did one. Do an event. By chance, you meet a tamer traveling through the region and looking for some work. Offer to train one of your employees for half price. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Okay, don't go there yet. Uh, if this guy's back. I did. I think I did send. Yeah, I did send some away. I didn't want to send him away. Um, all right. So you're gonna go there. Actually, that's gonna work out all right. Oops. Um, you go there. So these three will defend that room, and then we've got these three for this room. I kind of maybe want to use Anpu here for something. Is Anpu better than this guy? I think I like it like this. Okay, this is it. 44 weeks in a, in a year. In a, in a demon year. The marketing team has decided to add a resting area to our dungeons. It seemed essential to find a solution to attract seasoned adventurers more efficiently than the competition. <laughs> okay. What does that do? There's two penalties with the most stacks applied from all the heroes. That's not cool. Um, so we maybe we should put our trap over here, I guess. I think. Um, oh, that doesn't really matter. We'll do this guy. Oh, never mind. Uh, okay, so what do we got? You are the champion. A, a champion dwarf does lots of air damage in the front. Nature in the middle. Ice. Uh, I guess wherever you feel. The slow guy. Lots of air damage. Who wants to defend you? Air, air. You resist a lot of air damage. You don't have a lot of hit points, but you're gonna resist that. You're gonna you're gonna hit nature in the middle, which I think is gonna be you. And he's gonna be slow, going slow, which is fine because you guys are all slow. And you get to do your thing twice. Now, it just gives shell to us, not to them. So I think that's that's the better one. And stack their penalties. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We get to have a break. We get to do our, our thing. We may we may throw some tears at it if we need to. I think we got this one, no problem. Hey, Tom. Tom, it's so early. What are you doing awake? I think I'm going to throw... I'm going to put this guy in the back because they're so slow anyway. I think he's going to go in the back. To me. Okay, we'll start out with our scare. And then this guy is going to get to go twice, right? That pill thing. Yeah, he is. So much tiredness. Uh. 
Here we go, finally. Sinister Roots. Nature damage and does Demoralize, which is just a morale thing. And... Or 15 air and 19 morale damage dealt increased by... If it's demoralized. Are you demoralized? You are. Okay. Sure, sure. Should in the first one first and then come back for the demoralized. He only did 18 damage. Keep the tiredness going. I don't know if we need to stack it this high. Does this remove two penalties with the most stacks? Okay, we'll see what it does. We get to moralize everybody. Let's do this one. If he survives around, I don't think he's gonna. Then we can get the other one in. Yeah, maybe it'll be a skeleton. Yeah, maybe not. I think it has to be. I guess it's any monster. It comes back. The most heinous of thoughts, Tom. Now, I think um, Oklahoma City, uh, I live nearby, uh, their claim to fame is uh, they invented the parking meter back in like the, you know. 40s or whatever. But that's that's what Oklahoma City did. Oh, that's what Oklahoma City did for the world. That and only that. <laughs> We're immune for three rounds, so uh, that's great. How much tears do I have? Does it say where my tears? Where's my tears at? I have 89 tears. Um, summon two random mummy mummies. No, I think we're just gonna go and and. Each use costs 20 additional tiers. Let's just hit this one first. Just get five rounds in vulner vulnerability. And then we'll, um... Then we'll just keep on smacking them. Like that. <laughs> so much immunity. This is easy fight. Too easy. Should have been Egyptian a long time ago. Okay, so this is my last round. I think we we could either we could do this one and then you know I got the tears. Let's spend them. I'll be vulnerable more just to mess with these guys because it's funny. I'll throw out some uh, some, some mummies. Those aren't mummies. <laughs> They're gonna die. Uh, and then let's, uh, yeah, let's scare that guy. There you go, buddy. Yeah, yeah, take that. Still immune? I don't think I need to be immune again. Really? I suppose folks stop in this state for some reason. I haven't figured out why yet. <laughs> Apparently someone stopped. And they got charged for it. We thought, like... <laughs> it's like no one's stopping. We got one. What do we do? I don't know. Charge him. <laughs> that was our solution. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Knock that guy around. Summon some more mummies while you're at it. Get out of here. 
We don't even need the final row. That's how tough that is. I see. Demons are acting as psychopomps <laughs> to carry forward your good word. But your reputation might be growing too fast. Ow. Our informants report that the Academy of the Logic God have declared a crusade against the instigators of this new pagan religion. Be careful. And then I bellowed, this tomb will be your tomb. <laughs> oh, share, share that on, on, Not on Twitter. Bad, eh? Pop it up. What's it say? Uh, it, didn't, it didn't make a tweet. It just opened a Twitter. Okay. 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 <laughs> no Levels. One, come on, bring the sacrifices. Okay. All right. Oh, well, there we go. And then we can do it again. And all over again. What do we get to do? It's level three with Enchantress, which is who? You. Oh, what the game? Okay. I see. It is inevitable. I think I played her before. So many ideas. I don't know. Okay. Well, there we go. There is uh is Legend of Keepers. The new, uh, the new, the new DLC. Just like that. Mm. It is out uh, now. I'll uh, show off the Steam page here in seconds. Uh, right over here. It's out now. Uh, there's Steam page. Thanks for sponsoring this video, uh, uh, Goblin Studio. And uh, and I think we're gonna call it there. It's on sale, by the way, for uh, for a bit. Um, both of them are the the base game and the uh, and the expansion. But I'm going to wrap it up there. I was going to do a bit more um, Timberborn, but I'm tired. So, um, and yes, that hippo did just yell at you. So, um, I think uh, we'll wrap it up here. I, I may come back and check out some more Timberborn later, but um, I think I'm just going to end it here tonight. So, uh, thanks for hanging out, everybody. Um, uh, th thanks for uh, for joining me on a uh, uh, an early 